Hey, welcome back. This is day two. Seven days to die. Soul spawn. That's me. Yeah. We got a couple of uh, zombies hanging around out here. Hi, zombie. How are you? What's up? Look at you go. Um, yeah, that thing I forgot to mention that I changed uh, at the beginning of last episode, the first episode, is I have mornings starting at 4 right now. So that's a thing. Like the, I like to balance it out kind of thing. Like longer 24-hour cycle, but at the same time, have the nights a little bit shorter so I have more time to actually do stuff. More time to build cool things, gather cool things, so I can show it to you. Hi. What's up? Oh no, I'm bleeding out. That's not good. Can you like... Die. Alright, well I guess I'm using uh, my last bandage, maybe? No, I'm not. No, I'm not. There we go. All good. So, purpose of this episode, or rather what we're doing, we've got our place. Nice place to hide. I need to gather a bunch of, like, resources and materials and whatnot so we can actually do things. And I guess that also means a bit of exploring as well, which is cool. Um, so... What do we need to get? What do we need to get? We need lots of wood. We need lots of stone. We need cotton. Come on, give me that cotton right there. And I guess other miscellaneous things that we find too. Like food would be good, more jars. Do I have my, uh? yes, I have my empty jars on me. That's good. We need to find a nice water source as well. And yeah. I guess I'll start looking around. I see water over there, maybe. We'll go check that out. Yeah, I'll start looking around, seeing what I can find and whatnot. And if I find anything interesting, I'll be sure to hit that record button. All right, so something I just learned about uh, the PC version here, is that when you get hungry and thirsty, your uh, stamina bar, like the max stam stamina you can have, goes down with it. So like I was stuck at like 50 stam stamina for the entire time I was out there so far. And yeah, got hungry, got thirsty, drank a little bit of water, nothing happened. And uh, yeah. Just thought I'd share that, my uh, own newbie discovery. Yeah. I'm very curious about this. It seems to be some sort of a uh, camp or something. All walled off and everything. I bet you there's zombies in here. 100% bet ya. But I want to go in. I'm going to see what I can find. Got to be careful. Let's uh, start breaking tires, see if I can get a tire. Nope, I just got a bunch of... Oh. Yep. What the hell is this? Oh. Hi, zombies. How's it going? I almost want to use my gun, but I know I shouldn't. Let's just knife you to death. Come on, bring it. Got you. Come on, got you. You're dead. Hi, what are you doing? Little, little piggy, Mr. or Mrs. Boar, I don't know. Oh, destroyed chemistry station, what's an Oh, dude, dude, that's perfect. We can build a chemistry station now. Excellent. That's exciting. Look at the little, uh, beware of dog. Do I actually have to beware of dogs? 
I really would prefer not to be beware of dogs. What? Where? Oh, I can search this vehicle. That's cool. Come on. Okay, let's take all of it. What? Jesus Christ! Where'd you come from? Come on. Piece of shit. Yeah, that's right, you fuck off. Ah. Alright. Let's use this. Use this. I found another one. Ah, that's how they did. They broke out. Come on. I should be very cautious of this stuff. Oh, no. That's right. Okay. Uh, okay, so this was like a chemistry... Like, uh... Like a little camp for, like, uh... Maybe military or whatever? Ooh. Medical pile. Okay. Let's take all of that. And... Reinforced chest. What do we got in here? Oh... Let's take that. What? How? How do I do this? Decreases encumbrance penalty by one installing this much modification into your armor. Oh. Okay, we're gonna wear the hood. Uh, scrap advanced weapons and tools and acquire these items. Okay. Well. I'm going to put you there because you're done. And I'm going to put you there. Beautiful. That's excellent. We found things. Is there anything to be found over here? Nope. Just got to break into this. And then I got to make a trip back home because I've got a lot of things. Let's see what we get in here. Anything good? Show me things. A potato. Oh, man. Okay, I've got to grab the potato. Is there anything I don't want in here? No, I kind of want it all. The whole purpose of this is to be out and about. Gathering things. But there's... Oh, more medical stuff. Take you. This pig just wants to chill out, you know? It's all in here and everything. I'm not going to hit you. I know you'll attack me if I hit you. Can you please leave me alone? Okay. I'll take all of that. Oops. Well, this is fun. The rush to get your stuff back is always, always fun. I see a deer. Let's see if we can get it with our uh, bow and arrow here first. Nope. Hey. Nope. Did I get it? Did I kind of get it? I don't know if I'm getting it or not. I think I need to get closer. I got it. Nice. And I know there's another zombie over here. Hey, big guy. What you doing? Yeah, got you right in the mouth. Oh, missed you. Come on. Come on. Got you, maybe. Hey. Aha. Thank you for that. Now, let's go to this deer. Wait. I need a bone knife. Because I don't got one. Alright, come on, hurry up. I just need this meat. Gotta get the meat. And now, the slow walk home. Yay! 
Oh wait, there should be an airdrop soon. There it is. Drop it. Drop it. Drop it. Is that gonna be right on my house? I hope that's right on my house. That looks like it's gonna be really close to my house. That's beautiful. All right, well, I'm gonna go drop this stuff off and then we'll go see what's in that airdrop. We've got a huge issue. A very huge issue. There's a fucking bear right there. Um, what's in here? This guy dropped something. I'm going to scrap that. Okay. Okay. This is a thing. I wonder if I can one-shot this bear. Where did it go? I am very, very concerned. Very, there it is. It's fighting something. What is it fighting? Did it just fight? All right. All right. What? Oh! Holy shit. That was... Interesting. Okay, that was so close. Give me all your meat. Well, I found the supply drop. My home's literally that building right over there, if you could see the top corner of it there. I've got to come back for this. I'm not sure if it, uh, if it still drops all the stuff that's in it if you, like, exit the inventory once you enter it for the first time. I don't want to test that out right now because I will not be able to pick everything up. Okay, all my stuff is dropped off. I got some food and water cooking. Now, let's see what's in the supply drop. Okay, ooh, a junk turret. That's beautiful. Got some food and honey and shotgun. Let's take it all. Yes, the crate still breaks. Excellent. We are actually looking pretty good. And we got ourselves a zombie here. Let's take this guy out. Look at you. What's up? Hi. Eat my spear. Are you dead? Stay dead. Good zombie. Now, I think we got to start looking at how we can bulk this place up. Maybe. I want to see what we can do. We can get some, like, walls going or something, or maybe even um, some sort of balcony system where we can, like, walk around here killing zombies, you know, because Horde Knight will, like, show up pretty fast. Day seven, y'all. Day seven. So I'm thinking to survive our first Horde Knight, we need to get some sort of uh, thing going on here. Where we can like walk around or at least like get on the roof maybe. I don't know. I don't know. We'll have to figure it out. I need to cut down more trees. But we'll figure it out. Okay, so I just realized this. I have enough materials to make the forge. We're going to craft that right now because that's super duper important. That's going to open us up to metal tools and everything. Which is excellent. Very excellent. I'm so... I'm freaking excited. Um, But yeah, we don't have much more time to do anything this episode. This has basically been a big material gathering episode. Big material gathering. Maybe we'll go find a place to, uh, to search and stuff. I don't know. We'll figure it out. But first things first is we need this forge. Very badly. Very badly. I'm actually kind of excited for this forge. Kind of excited for this game in general. But, yeah. You know, the more and more I look at this place, the more and more I do, I feel like I can spend a lot of time here. Like, eventually I want to go off and uh, build my own big base and stuff and everything, but we need to uh, get all of our uh, things like all of our like our workbench, like all of our material processing stuff before we even think about that. 
So I'm thinking Cole's books here is where we're going to live for quite a long time. And we've got lots of room here to do things. Ooh, there's the forge. Lots of room to do things. Uh, like rooms for farms, if we can get to there. We got a trader literally right next door, which is awesome. All right, so we want to put you right there. What do you got going on in here? All right, so yeah, obviously we got all of our our good stuff here. Forge steel, crucible required. What the hell is a crucible? I don't know what that is. But Okay, so yeah, we have to go into our own individual things here. Brick. Holy shit, bulletproof glass. That's kind of cool. But we got to figure out what a crucible is. I don't see any thing in here. Metal trussing beams. Ooh. That's cool. That's really cool. So there's our rock stuff. Our... Whatchamacallit, our bullet stuff. Anvil. We need an anvil schematic for that, apparently. Huh. Cooking pot, cooking grill. We can do a cooking grill. That's awesome. So I'm going to take half of that, put that in there. Get a cooking grill going. Because we need a cooking grill to make better food. We'll put the rest of our clay in here. And turn that on. Attract all the screamers. Because why not? It'll get interesting. Now, I'm going to pick up my stuff. Go uh, visit that trader. See what I can sell. I'm going to put all this stuff back in here. Where are we here? What can we sell? What do we want to sell? I just traded with him. Didn't really have anything I can afford. I hear you, zombie, or whatever you are. Um, but do you have any jobs? Ooh. What's this? So buried supplies, fetch, buried supplies. Okay. That sounds cool. No, we'll do the buried supplies. Why are you friend? And that's why I'm asking you for a help. Alright. So, one of my couriers had a little run-in with uh, Cazador Lackey. He was able to lose him, but had to bury the shipment. I'm only interested in our supplies. You can keep the rest of the loot. Be warned, this courier isn't playing with the full deck, so he, so the mark on the map may be a little off. Don't forget, you're going to need a shovel. Godspeed. Thank you. So, it's just over that way. Let's check our map. Oh, yeah, I've been there before. Let's go do it. Let's go do it. Whoa. All right, buried supplies. Oh man, this terrain is very, very hard to navigate. Well, not really very hard, just annoying, I guess. Ooh, a bird's nest. What do you got for me? Just four feathers. Okay. Is there anything in that hole? Ooh, wait, wait. There's kind of a odd little thing over here. Of course it needs repairs. What does it do? There we go. Excellent. Hey, look, it's right there. Excellent. I did it. Learning elixir. What the hell is that? Pumpkin seed. Okay. Let's take all that. Oh, shit. I, I gotta get out of here. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Oh. Okay. This is not good. This is not good at all. Not good. Holy shit. What the fuck? You stay out of my hole. Piss off. Okay. What the hell? All right, let's let's uh let's fucking run back. That's crazy. Oh no. 
Oh, no. Okay, so that's one zombie. There's another zombie hanging around there. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay. Onwards. Let's go return this job. All right. We are here. We are here. All prices are fair here. Yeah? You did it. I did Great do it. Great job, traveler. Ooh, I get to choose what I get. Nice. Um. Ooh, I also get some tokens. That's beautiful. And I choose one. Um. You know what? I've already got shotguns. I'm going to choose the antibiotics just in case I get infected. So. Yeah. Complete. Thank you very much. You're the best. You know, what else do you got? Okay, so this is the fetch. Lots of fetches. Buried supplies. I'm gonna try a, a fetch, maybe. Can you do me a favor? Okay, so one of our operatives had to stash the equipment at Old West Business 13. <laughs> Go retrieve the shipment and return to me. Oh, thank you very much. I will make it worth your while. You're very welcome. Now, where the hell is this on my map? Okay, so it's a fair ways away. Maybe we'll do that tomorrow. Because we're getting pretty close to not being uh, good enough to go anywhere. Like, it's getting going to be nighttime soon. Going to be nighttime soon. That's what I'm trying to say. I don't know what the hell I'm talking about. All right, so I think it'd be smart to start crafting some things. Maybe. Probably smack down a couple more trees, too. I don't know. But I'm really happy we can get quests from this guy to, like, earn things. It makes me very happy. Let's go see how our forge is doing. Because we've been letting it go for quite a while now. Okay, we're going to turn that off. We've got lots of iron. Oh, I can do the cooking grill. Let's craft you. Get going. Nice. Come on. You can do it. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. And there we go. Turn you off. And we'll put you right in there. Beautiful. And that means we can make some grilled meat, maybe. No. What? Oh, I got to do the things. I leveled up, didn't I? I think I did. I might have to check. Okay, so I've been doing some thinking, and yes, we're definitely going to fortify this place for the foreseeable future anyway. Um, But that'll be next episode. As you can see, we're getting close to nighttime. We don't want to be stuck out here building while zombies are running around trying to kill us, and we won't be able to see really well in the night anyway. But yeah. So next episode, day three, is going to be building this. We're going to fortify this all nice and proper for the first horde night. Just so we don't have to rush and do it like uh, right before horde night begins because that's always fun. Yeah. And we'll also head over and do that second job there so we can get more money. To spend there because we need schematics and stuff and this guy sells some schematics I want. I want that hunting knife schematic. I also want that marksman rifle he's got there. But anyway, I'm going to prepare for sticking out the knight in here. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. And yeah, super happy I got this done. This is the, the main highlight of the episode right here. I uh, sorted out my storage here a little bit as well. I've got food and medicine stuff right in here, right beside the fire here. I've got ammunition and guns. 
and parts for that stuff as well right here and then this is like other miscellaneous stuff i still have to move some things but we're looking good we're looking all right anyways thank you very much for watching if you want to see more please be sure to let me know in the comments down below and i'll see you next episode day three fun times <laughs>